The classic styling of the iPhone SE means you're able to use any of the leftover iPhone 5S cases you have lying around. But if you want to show your SE off in style, there are plenty of awesome new cases to keep your 4 inch iPhone looking cooler than the other side of the pillow. Let's get started. We're all praying for wireless charging to come to the iPhone 7, but in the meantime, the dog and bone wireless charging case and pad brings all that capability to your SE. The case consists of two main parts, the main shock absorbent rubber case itself and a removable pad which plugs into the lightning port to add the wireless charging. The case does add a fair bit of bulk to the SE, especially on the chin at the bottom, but all that extra padding means it can handle knocks and drops from up to 4 feet. On the back there's this honeycomb type pattern which adds a little bit of extra grip and a splash of colour, and comes in 4 different variations including red and pink. Of course, the main feature of this case is the wireless charging, and for that to work you have a removable wireless receiver which works in conjunction to the charging pad, or any Qi charger. The wireless receiver also has a micro USB port, so you can use any micro USB cables you have lying around. The power buttons, mute switch and volume buttons are all accessible, but the lightning port is covered with the receiver, although you can just remove this if needed. Due to the larger chin at the bottom, you'll need to use an adapter to access the headphone jack which can be a bit of a pain to carry around, although you can get around it by using Bluetooth headphones. The receiver can also be switched out with a battery, which is sold separately for an extra $50, but in return you'll get around half a charge for your SE. If you've seen the What's On My iPhone SE video, then you would have already seen the sticky case from Xvida, but it's still one of my favourite cases for the SE. It's super slim and has a nice, soft, rubberized texture which also protects the back of the phone. And the front is also protected thanks to a lip around the edge. The case also has a soft lining inside to protect from scratching your phone when installing and removing. However, the best thing about this case is if you invest into Xvida's magnetic ecosystem. Xvida provide a ton of magnetic mounting systems for everything from car mounts for when you're using the phone as a sat-nav, as well as this bike or stroller kit so you can secure your phone to the handlebars when riding about. And on top of all that, if it breaks, Xvida will exchange it for free. So what's not to love? If you're familiar with this channel, you'll already know one of my favourite brands for tech accessories is Grovemade. I've already got a ton of their products including my monitor stand and keyboard tray, but they've also got an amazing wooden and leather case for the SE. Available in two different colour combinations, you can either pick up the maple and tan leather, which is great if you have a white iPhone, or the black leather and walnut case if you're like me and have a black SE. Installation is easy, simply slide in the iPhone starting at the bottom, then use the adhesive leather back to stick on the rear. It does add a slight bulk around the edges, but not enough to make the phone awkward to hold or use. Of course, with the leather back being adhesive, you're not going to be able to take this case on and off. But once you've got it on, there's not much chance you're going to want to take it off anyway. The level of detail on this is incredible, from the actuated wood power and volume buttons all the way to the awesome corners, which is all hand sanded and oiled. It's not the best case to protect your phone in the event of a drop, so if you're fairly clumsy, one of the rubber or plastic cases will be a safer bet. But if you want to stand out from the crowd, the Grovemade case is certain to help you do just that. Signet has always been a great brand for iPhone cases. The Aero Shield is perfect if you want great protection without hiding the gorgeous appearance of the SE. It's made out of a combination of a hard plastic shell to protect from impacts, and a rubber frame for shock absorption and to make the case easy to install or remove. The rubber edges of the case make the phone a lot grippier, and it's also super slim, meaning the compact size of the SE isn't really affected. All buttons and ports are accessible, with the volume buttons and power button protected under the frame of the case. The case comes in three different shades of either clear, blue trim, or this grey trim I have on here. Again, the case does have a lip on the front to protect the screen when placing it face down, but Signet also offers a great screen protector for extra security. Last, but definitely not least, is the Life Proof Nude, which offers the ultimate protection for your SE. Not only is it drop proof, but it's also dirt proof and waterproof. As you might not expect, the screen is completely uncovered, but maintains its waterproof status by creating a tight seal around your screen so you've got direct access, although it does come with a screen protector just in case you're worried about scratching your screen. Best of all, it's rated for up to 6.6 .6 feet of submersion for a maximum of 2 hours. I know from personal experience that this case really protects your phone from a drop. It does add a little bit of bulk, but it still fits into your pocket without a problem. It's an absolutely amazing case that is a must buy if you're out adventuring. Well, that's it for this video, I'll make sure to leave links to all the cases below, but let me know in the comments section which iPhone SE case is your favourite. 
If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and smash that like button, and if you haven't already, don't forget to hit subscribe so you don't miss a single video from Cult of Mac. I'll catch you in the next one.